so this video is for standard 8 mathematics so the question says a car with speed 80 kilometers take 8 hours to travel some distance okay so first we will need to check that whether this is direct proportion or indirect proportion so when the speed increases so the time taken to travel that distance will get reduced means one quantity increases another quantity decreases so this is a inverse proportion okay so if i take speed as s and the time taken as t so i can say that speed is inversely proportional to the time taken okay so we can write this as s is equal to k t okay so in next step i can say s into t is equal to k where k is the constant of proportion now we will put the values as given in the problem that is speed is 60 kilometers per hour and the time taken is 8 hours so speed is 60 and the time taken is 8 hours so when we multiply we will get 480 so we can say k that is the constant of proportion is 480 so now we can write the equation of proportion as that is s into t is equal to k and the value of k we got as 480 okay so now we have the equation of proportion and now the second part of the question what should be the increase in the speed if the same distance is to be covered in seven and a half hours now what they are saying that find the increase in the speed to find the increase in the speed first we need to find the speed so that the distance is covered in seven and a half hours so when we talk about this seven and a half hours the second part of the question here the t is given seven and a half which can be written as 7.5 hours okay or this can be solved and like 2 2 7 is a 14 plus 1 is equal to 15 by 2 so if you are comfortable with decimal you can use the 7.5 otherwise you can convert this into fraction that is 15 by 2 so now t is 15 by 2 so now we have the equation of proportion as s into t is equal to 480 now we need to find the speed when the time is seven and a half which we calculated here as 15 by 2 so s into 15 by 2 is equal to 4 8 0 so when we find the speed okay to cover the same distance in seven and a half hours 4 8 0 into 2 divided by 15 when we solve this we will get s is equal to 64 kilometers per hour so the speed should be 64 kilometers per hour so that the same distance will be covered in seven and a half hour instead of eight hours okay so the speed has to increase so that the same distance can be covered in less hours but we have been asked to find what should be the increase in speed not the speed increase in speed means we have to find the difference between the original speed and now the increase speed so we have like we need to find increase in speed so now the speed for covering the same distance in seven and a half is 64 kilometers per hour and earlier the speed was 60 kilometers per hour to cover the distance in eight hours that was 60 so the difference is four kilometers per hour so this is the increase in the speed so that 
we can achieve the same distance in seven and a half hours.